Friends, welcome to all of you for the home remedies for today. The part of home remedies we are going to study about, we are going to learn the wonderful mudra. Friends, this mudra, <clears throat> this mudra especially, it is the mudra <clears throat> which is, we can say like, you know, the most crucial mudra which is going to help everybody at the crisis, at the crucial moment, you not know, the crisis of the time, whenever anybody is facing the heart issues, the heart pain, chest pain, heart attack, even after heart attack or during the heart attack. So all the timings, you know, such is the cruciality of this mudra. That is the high importance of this mudra, my dear friends. So this mudra is called Apana Vayu Mudra. This mudra is a combination of two mudras, Apana Mudra, Vayu Mudra. Okay. So this mudra is also called Sanjeevani Mudra, Mrutha Sanjeevani Mudra. So why we call it as Mrutha Sanjeevani, Mrutha Sanjeevani Mudra? It means it is going to stop the death of the person due to heart attack or due to heart pain. At the time of the death also, it will try to revive the person. That's why it's called Mrutha Sanjeevani Mudra. So it's a Sanjeevani Mudra. So and also your health of the heart will be quite longer. It means your health of the heart will be so much protected and your health of the heart will be so, so pure and so great because of the this mudra practice okay this is called apana mudra so how to practice this apana mudra let's see that okay so apana vayu mudra so especially friends as i told you it's a combination of apana mudra and vayu mudra right so what is apana mudra apana mudra we have seen right apana mudra is this like this, this is apana mudra and what is the what is the vayu mudra vayu mudra is this okay this is a vayu mudra Okay, so this is a Vayu Mudra, this is a Apana Mudra. Combination of these two is called Apana Vayu Mudra. That means keep it here, so keep it like this. See what happened? This especially forefinger must touch the base of the thumb. Okay, after touching the base of thumb, then these two middle finger and ring finger slowly, gently touch the, the tip of the thumb, and other two, yeah, other two little finger must be straight upward. So this is the mudra we have to do like this mudra and then keep on the thighs and then start practicing. Okay, how much time and all we have given here. So we need to follow that. So especially this mudra, whenever you practice mudra, before practicing mudra, you can have a little water, you can drink a little water and also sit straight and comfortably and take some three, four breathings. After that, you start you start going to this bhangima, this mahatya mudra, this hand mudra and then start mudra, mudra practice and how much time you need to do. So this is a question. So how much time we need to practice this mudra whenever you have any such kind of problems, any heart related issues, gastric, all these things, you know. So whenever it happens, so you must start using this mudra, especially Apana Vai Mudra. So you have to practice for 30 to 45 minutes, okay, in one go, 30 to 45 minutes, try to use it, okay. So if it is more and more problem, 15 minutes also in one go, you can use it. This very, very powerful mudra, my dear friends. So immediately today itself, you have to start practicing if you have any issues. If you don't have any issues, just 8-10 minutes, use. you just practice and leave it for a day, not a problem. But at the same time, so anybody is having problems, they have to practice for a more time. So that is essential. At the same time, from today itself, after learning this today, from tomorrow onwards, you have to keep telling this mudra to everybody. Whoever come across you, please tell this mudra. Okay? Many of the people will be saved out of their dangerous situations also. Okay, so that is why everybody you have to inform this mudra from tomorrow itself. Tomorrow itself, my friend, you have to take the oath of you know spreading this mudra at free of cost without charging anybody. We have to tell we have to do our seva. Okay, our seva is spreading this mudra to everyone around you, near you, nearby you, whoever come you come across. You please tell this mudra. Okay, so I used to do the same thing. Right, whenever I meet anybody, any new person, first I teach this mudra. That is the importance. I also te teach them how to practice it. Then they start practicing. Then they, they save their lives. Okay. More or, more or less, it will save the life itself. Okay. Fine. So after doing this mudra for anybody who is who is having ailment, the, all these ailments are there, diseases are there, they have to practice 30, 40, 30 to 40, 50 minutes at one shot. Then after that, followed by prana mudra. Prana mudra also, they have to practice 15 minutes. So that any mudra followed by prana mudra, that uh, mudra effectiveness will be more. Okay, you have to remember this. Now, we try to see what are the other benefits of Apana Vai Mudra, friends. Okay, so this mudra is considered very beneficial for heart diseases. As I told you already, 
It provides instant relief to a person suffering from heart attack and helps to keep blood pressure under control. Okay. So that's that's one thing. So that's what we have learned right now. So how this Apan Mudra is going to be much helpful for the any heart related issues. Immediately it will work. And this is proven also through one study published in 2017. It helps normalize heart rate and blood pressure by activating the so parasympathetic nervous system, my dear friends. So with which it will try to bring your blood pressure into control. Okay, so it's very very important application, very very important benefit of the this mudra. Now, or what are the other benefits of the this same mudra, the apana vayu mudra? Let's see. The second benefit provide relief from acidity, gas, and digestive problems. Okay, so it's going to provide a lot of relief if you keep doing this practice, and even gastric acidity, digestion, all the digestion issues. Okay, and also detox for the body. You have to it will detox with the body also. What it does is it makes sure that all your excretion, the like you know, mala mutra, so all these things goes out properly, and it improves the respiratory functions. It helps the manage anxiety and stress also. It reduces so improves uh, liver and gall gallbladder function, and which helps in combating the diabetes basically. So this is also going to help other diabetes patients activate the parasympathetic nervous system to quickly calm the mind. Okay, so it brings a lot of peace of mind. Okay. And it helps to treat symptoms, symptoms of insomnia and induce restful sleep. It produces a lot of good sleep, my dear friends, by practicing this. And promotes mental well-being and reduces negative emotions like anxiety, irritability, anger, etc. So it is going to be much helpful in this kind of a, any kind of a, uh, the, whatever the anger comes, all the negative emotions. That point of, uh, whenever you find more negative emotions within you, is going to be much helpful you practice this mudra. So balance out all three doshas, vata, pitta, kapha. These doshas will be balanced out, they'll be balanced out if you practice, if you keep practicing this mudra. So it's going to be, once these three doshas are getting balanced, so in your physical body, no disease will happen. So no disease will come to the physical body, my dear friends. So, so now the last and the final, so the helps manage physical pains like migraine, headache, back pain, menstrual cramps, ETC. It means any migraine headache and any kind of headache, back pain, all these things will be, so it will be managed. You know, it's, it's, it helps to manage any kind of pain out of all these things. Okay? Any kind of uh, the pain comes out of all these things will be managed well if you use the upon mudra regularly right so now so what are the precautions there are few precautions only not much precautions so try to follow these things so what you have to do is the upon why mudra increases the earth element people with the high kapha dosha or kapha constitution should handle it with a caution so that means they should not practice more time okay so once you feel that your problem is solved you must stop this performing the mudra at the time maybe healthy people can practice maybe 5 to 8 minutes or 10 minutes. Okay, not more than 10, 10 minutes. If all ill health people, they can use for 15 minutes also. But once the disease come, disease, they come out of the disease, they must not continue this mudra. Maybe they can practice for a prevention is better than cure. You can practice for approximately about 10 minutes. Okay, every day. Now, so do not put too much pressure on the fingers. Okay, this is already we have explained. So this, whatever the fingers you touch, it should be a feather touch. It should not be a very... So it should be a gentle touch, not the with a much more pressure should not be applied whenever you are doing the any mudra, right? So now the conclusion of this uh, apana vai mudra, which we are trying to understand today, the elements fire, earth, space, and air are all brought together in the apana vai mudra, which is believed to have healing effects. So people suffering from the heart problems in the fast should practice this apana vai mudra daily. Even you are, you are already suffering also, you can practice this mudra daily. Basically, you are all suffering already. They must practice this mudra on the everyday basis. They must practice. Okay. Who are, who are not suffering, it is up to them to practice maybe 8 to 10 minutes you know, every day. Even if you don't have any medical problems, Apana Vai Mudra can help you, can keep your heart healthy. Or your health, your heart health will be so longer. Like what they say is, so almost like you can keep your health heart. So for 100 years long, you can keep it healthy if you keep practicing this Apana Vai Mudra. So my dear friends, with this, we try to understand Apana Vai Mudra, Rota Sanjeevani Mudra today as a part of our home remedies. So thank you very much. Thanks to all of you for participating in this session, this uh, spiritual wisdom, meditation practice. 
and also holistic lifestyle and the home remedies. So once again, the name of everyone and Mother Foundation expresses sincere thanks. And also we request all of you to share and uh, subscribe Mahata TV, which is going to have the all the recordings so loaded into this. And you can always view, always watch all the old videos, all the old programs and all the upcoming programs, everything you can be able to watch in the Mahata TV. Thank you very much.